Jones County family of six loses everything to fire. Now some people are calling on the community to help them get back on their feet. WHLT's Candace Coleman reports. Amanda and Rayford Cromwell, along with their four children, lived in this home on Old Schoolhouse Road for 12 years. They lost everything in Sunday's fire. Now some people who love them dearly are asking others for help. This little family was in here yesterday. They could have been sulking. They could have been upset. They could have thrown their toys out of their playpen, but they didn't. They have a positive attitude. Is that why I consider them worthy? Yes, ma'am. Amanda's boss at Pasquale's Restaurant in Laurel speaks passionately about the Cromwell family and their situation. He says Amanda recently had surgery and begged her doctor to come back to work after the fire happened. I consider almost a daughter, me and my wife, uh, and especially where there's a little family involved, four, four kids, it, it doesn't make it any easier. It's not easy at all for the Cromwells. Firefighters ruled the cause of the fire, improper use of electrical equipment. With no insurance, Amanda and Rayford and the kids, whose ages range from 6 to 11, are squeezed into a camper. The kind of person she is, she's not asked for anything for her or Ray. She's just for the kids. Friends and neighbors have set up a GoFundMe account on the Cromwells' behalf. At our last check, it has raised 90 of $2,500. I, I feel like giving people an opportunity to help her is also helping them to receive a blessing. Connecting you to Pine Belt News in Jones County, Candace Coleman, WHLT 22. Thank you, Candace. Visit our website for more information on how you can help the Cromwell family.